Welcome to the Copenhagen Wheel, the wheel that turns your ordinary bike into a smart electric hybrid. The Copenhagen Wheel allows you to capture the energy dissipated while braking and cycling, and save it for when you need a bit of a boost. It's incredible. It takes no effort. You start pedaling and the motor takes over. And imagine that you have the second person behind you, you know, putting in extra pedal power. Uh, suddenly you're, you have the strength of Lance Armstrong. We work with new types of technology at MIT. Our office actually looks at how emerging technologies are integrated into cities and how we can solve problems of livability and sustainability. We initially uh, were talking with the mayor's office in the city of Copenhagen. And I don't know if you've been to Copenhagen, but it's an incredible city for cycling. About 36% of people cycle to work each day. But the mayor's office is interested in increasing this number. And so the idea is that it can be retrofitted onto any bike. The wheel has a number of sensors in it, environmental sensors, uh, carbon monoxide, NOx, noise, relative humidity, temperature. In Copenhagen, there's three static environmental monitors in the city, giving readings at um, two second intervals. You put your iPhone on the handlebar, the Bluetooth in the iPhone syncs with the back wheel of the bike. You can see all of the data that your wheel is collecting. The Copenhagen wheel connects you with things a cyclist wants to know. Upcoming traffic congestion, road conditions, and pollution levels. You can see whether you'd like to, you know, travel through somewhere more green. Choose to keep your data, or share it with your friends and other cyclists through social networks like Facebook. But the real power of distributed computing comes when you share or, or donate that data perhaps to the city. From that, cities can cross-analyze different types of information, noise pollution, um, level of particulates in the environment. Currently, we're in the final prototyping phase and the cost is looking at being around 500 to 600 US dollars. We would love to see this everywhere. We're currently looking at partnering with various cities um, to first and foremost get it out as, as bike fleets. So for me, engineering has always been about solving real world problems. I'm focused on, on cities and sustainability and livability in cities. And really, this is about you know, having a vision. And it wouldn't have been possible unless we had such a multidisciplinary group of people. We had an electrical engineer, a mechanical engineer, we had people from the Department of Urban Studies and Planning, uh, we had architects, computer scientists. It only took about six of us um, and a little bit of funding, a little bit of you know, outside support to get something which we hope will go to market and, and really change the world. Elegant, responsive, smart. A new mode of transport for a rapidly changing world. So turn on your life and turn on the city. The Copenhagen Wheel.